The Department of Indigenous Affairs is no more. It's actually one more. Yes, everyone's favorite bureaucracy has split into two Crown Indigenous Relations and Indigenous Services. Last week, newly crowned Indigenous Services Minister Jane Philpott outlined some of what her new department will actually do. Indigenous Services Minister Jane Philpott and her Deputy Minister Jean-Francois Tremblay outlined five priority areas in health, education, children and families, infrastructure and a new fiscal relationship. However, dollar figures mentioned at the press conference are not from new funding. The only promise of more dollars to come in the upcoming budget was in the area of child and families. As the government must comply with a human rights tribunal ruling to not discriminate between Indigenous and non-Indigenous children. I have described the Indigenous child welfare system in this country as a humanitarian crisis. Which sounds a little like what the old department did, but I'm curious what everybody in the Indigenous community thinks about this departmental split. So, joining me now is the Laughing Drums, Alyssa Kixon. Welcome, Alyssa. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Two departments, baby! Two departments! You're obviously very excited about this. I'm, I'm a little surprised. Well, wouldn't you be, Tim? What other segment of the population has two departments looking after their every needs, their every affairs? Two! <laughs> I guess that's right, but what's specifically about this is, is so exciting oh, for you. Oh, Tim, Tim, that means double the rights, double the status cards, double the land, hey? Uh, I don't think that that's what it means. I think they're just, they're, they're splitting the department, but one is dealing with services and one is dealing with rights. Wait, what? Yeah, no. they're, they're, just, they're, they're just dividing the work. It doesn't mean double, double rights. What? Uh, I'm so <laughs> God. <laughs> Thanks, Dustin. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, me quick. <laughs> <laughs> Melissa kicks in, everybody.